We've got news from CIG pertaining to November 1st roadmap roundup. We're going straight into it. Progress tracker, we have some additions in the progress tracker. The very first one is the Drake Cutter Scout. It says building, balancing, and implementing the Drake Interplanetary Reconnaissance Ship, the Cutter Scout, into the game. So this is good. The RSI Zoops Mark 2 is they're also saying building, balancing, and implementing the RSI small multi-cruise ship the zeus mark ii into the game this is huge so they're looking to get this thing up as soon as possible i'm thinking maybe summer of next year but at the very least by the end of the year of next year all right under the least view they've added a few additions as well targeting the stars is off of 3.21.1 the very first one here is the new mission data heist it says implementing the mission that tasks players with infiltrating locations often held by npcs reaching data stores and setting data to upload to off-site handler all right so targeting the q4 patch which is the star Citizen alpha 3.22 is going to be the player hair update they're adding it says here updating the star Citizen character customizer with 20 hairstyles from squad 42 this includes long hair tight hair and, and updates to existing short hair styles also they've added the salvage structural so this is going to be the munching salvage munching mechanic that they added here it says implementing the ability to transform large chunks of metal salvage from ships into refinable material this will use the grinder system aboard the salvage ship like the vulture and reclaimer huge 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 gameplay implications with this this is going to be awesome also they've added inventory cargo containers it says feature will allow players to store items and small cargo containers in larger cargo containers this is huge man there's going to be a lot of sandbox implications when it comes to cargo moving cargo and all these things it's it's this is huge i'm really excited for this and this is going to be the q4 patch I'll just let you guys know once again. All right. Also, the Apoa Santo Ye is also targeted for the Q4 patch as well. Building, balancing, and implementing the Apoa Medium Fighter, the Santo Ye, into the game. In addition to this, they also have the Origin X1 series. They have the X1, the X1 Velocity, as well as the X1 Force, also aiming for the 3.22 patch man this is a big year for cig just let y'all know if you're looking for an org consider my org phase one industries if you're new or veteran player we are now recruiting check out our discord in the description down below make sure to leave a like subscribe i'll catch you on the